Welcome to Matalio Tutorials. Today we're going to be covering in a bad position where our partner's got the underhook and the crossface from half guard, recovering from half guard to full guard transitioning. Okay. So we're going to start in a half guard position from here. Our partner's got both a strong crossface and the underhook on this side. Very bad for the, the person on bottom, okay? So we need to create, at the moment my partner's weight is directly on top of me. I need to shift this weight over in this direction, okay? So how we're going to do that, my outside foot here, I'm going to plant it on the mat and also on my same side hand, I'm going to use the bicep as a frame, like a strong bar against his face to shift his weight as I bridge his weight in this direction. So planting my foot, using my hand and bridging over in this direction, looking into the direction I'm bridging, it shifts my partner's weight. So now I can shrimp out, creating the space on this side so I can bring my knee on the inside of my partner's hip. From there, I like to put my knee directly on his hip bone and then just putting both my feet on this side together. Now from here, my partner's still got a strong gable grip. So my top hand, my free hand, I'm gonna weave on the inside, controlling the top shoulder from here. All I'm gonna do is use the frame, I'm gonna straighten my back to break this gable grip from here. Now both hands are gonna remain on the inside from here. Knee, I'm gonna bring to my chest. Here to straight up to your bottom leg, straight to your chest. Once you've done that, I can put my foot on my partner's hip. Both hands are going to come over the back of my partner's tricep. And as I pull my partner's arm towards me, I'm going to square my hips up. Here's a pull. And turn it into my partner. You can control the posture once I regain the full guard. Lock in nice and tight. And we'll just stop on that. Different angle. So from here. Very bad position for the person on top. We need to shift the weight in this direction. So my outside leg and the same side arm, the bicep is a nice strong frame, okay? If I just don't use this and bridge, it's not really gonna move. So outside leg, have it nice and firm on the mat. Bicep, bridging over in this direction. Once I've shifted my partner's weight, I can shrimp out just a little bit just to create this space. I can bring my knee on the inside of my partner's hip, here. Using my top hand, just come on the inside, weaving on the inside, nice grip on my partner's shoulder, the front of his belt, using my forearm as a frame. The gable grip is strong at this moment, so I need to use the frame and straighten my back at the same time to create the distance between me and my partner and break the grips. Both hands are on the inside, controlling the bicep. Knee to my chest, foot on the hip. Here, now come over the arm. As I pull my partner's arm closed, I'm going to uh, square my hips back up into my partner from here. Nice close guard, locking both legs around my partner's waist. Here, I can also control the posture to finish from there. One more angle from here. So you better see me plant the foot on the mat and also using the arm on this side, okay? So it's important now. In your bad position, plant the foot, outside foot, nice and firm on the mat. Bicep. Framing against my partner's face as I shift the weight and bridge over in this direction from here. Plant, nice big bridge, bicep, get my partner's face. At this moment, we're sort of shifting his weight, I can shrimp out just a little bit. See how I'm creating this space here? I can bring my top knee on the inside of my partner's hip, directly on his hip bone. So I decide to put both feet together like this. Now we're in this position, we're going to advance forward. So my top hand will weave on the inside of the shoulder from here. Now I can straighten, use my arm with the frame against his neck, here to break the game a bit. Both arms on the inside, knee to my chest, foot on the hip, square your hips back up, and again the full guard from there. If you like, you can control the posture to finish from here.